you're going to need some different So we have to get a man you stand in like this and put you together and then you own it. This is Quail Kilns Pottery. This business my parents started back in the 1940s in Stockton. We have a sort of an unusual business in that we start with really a raw material. We're digging dirt, we process dirt, clay, and then we also make product out of it. And so over the last 50 years, we've made over half a million pieces of pottery that have our family name on it. So we are an art pottery um, and one of the oldest existing ones in, in the state. Um, and uh, we have a showroom and a gallery where we show our work. Um, we do uh, individual pieces as well as dinnerware sets. About 80% of the clay that we mine comes from the lower end of Calaveras County. If I was going to find what looked like a likely source of clay, I would literally just dig some up, bring it home, slake it down, screen it a little bit, dry it out, make a ball out of it, see if it sticks together. It sticks together in a ball, make a pinch pot, see if that sticks together. If the pinch pot sticks together, fire it, see if it sticks together then. That gives me a lot of information and if it will stay and you look at the shrinkage of it and you look how it dries and so you basically test a lot of different mineral sources to see what, what works the best. We also are producing clay in an old-fashioned way but it makes for a wonderful product and so we do a wet mix and we and screen it and then we filter press the clay and so we end up with a clay that's very, the word is plastic, in terms of its plasticity. It's easy to work with, it's easily manipulated. So we end up with a very plastic um, product that's um, a high quality product. However, th we handle it more than our comp competition does. My favorite part is having somebody who walks in who knows nothing about what we're doing and how I can send them out uh, understanding how much, how large a part clay plays in their life. That it's their cosmetics, it's their pharmaceuticals, it's it's their car parts, it's uh, it's their computer chips, are all all uh, ceramic materials. The pottery that I make is lovely and functional, but no one needs what I make. I'm just really grateful when they want it, um, and so I I continue to try to make the most um, a sturdy, functional, and lovely product, and keep hoping that I have customers that'll come in and keep, keep uh, collecting it. Um, I have customers who are fourth generation customers. Um, so we have folks here in the county whose great grandparents had dinnerware from us. Their grandparents do, they've worked down and the kids are getting married and they're uh, gifting them with pieces from us now.